Mayor McVeigh has Ryan in captivity. Ah! I don't know what you did to them, but I will not allow you to sabotage my plans this time. Here's the thing. I have a plan. I can set up several remote detonators to your control panel, but you'll be blind. I'll have to stay on the inside and kill you when to set them off. How do you expect to do all this without the mayor noticing? I doubt anyone will be watching. A breakout. A well thought out breakout at that. Want me to have Tom Roland removed, sir? No, no. Let's see how this plays out. I want to see just how loyal Chief Roland is. There's a million ways out of the city. I don't know one. His way was to pursue birds with food in their mouths suitable for humans, snatching from them. Then the birds would follow and snatch it back. And they would all go chasing each other gaily for miles, parting at last with mutual expressions of goodwill. Dear God, how long has he been reading? <laughs> at least he's doing something. Not like that movie store guy. Still, fucking bookworm. Save him. Save him, they cried, looking with horror at the cruel sea far below. Are you a fan or just that good at finishing other sentences? I sent you the books. They're childhood favorites of mine. Listen, there's talk that they're going to execute you and John both if you don't comply. So John is here. His death was staged so no one would notice his disappearance. It all makes sense now. And now I'll suffer the same fate. Yes. Say, what's in that box over there? It's just the box the books came in. It's empty. Nothing's as empty as waiting to die, Ryan. Indeed, a million golden arrows were pointed out to the children, all directed by their friend the sun, who wanted them to destroy their way before leaving them for the night. Then unexplored patches arose in it and spread, and black shadows moved about in them. The roar of the beasts of prey was quite different now, and above all, you lost the certainty that you would win. When at last the heavens were steady again- Young! You have a phone call! I get phone calls? It was cleared by security. Don't try anything funny in there. Hello? Ryan, get down! Ben? What? Why? Get down, now! Ow, what the hell? Run! Rolling, you sly son of a bitch. Alright, Ryan got the gun. He's heading east. Okay, what does that mean? It doesn't mean anything for you until I tell you. Be prepared to set off the third charge in the east wing. Okay. Shit. Now! All right, what? What now? I don't know. The guards aren't in their regular stations for this kind of situation. So what does that mean? 
It means that- I changed it. What? Roland, what does it mean? Come with me, Tom. Let's clean up your mess. John! John, is that you? Uh, Ryan, listen here? to me. You have to go. I've got this under control. No, John, I'm not leaving, leaving you here. I'll get you oh, out, I promise. Sake. What the hell is with that? Uh, John? John! Ryan, get out of here. Let me back for you. Stop it right there, Private Young. You. No time for small talk. Let's go back to your cell. What were you going to ask the mayor? What? You know what I'm talking about. You wanted to ask the mayor something. What was it? I wanted to go home. He's been having me working non-stop with you. Now, back to your cell, and maybe he'll let Come me- Come with me. We're both prisoners here. Aren't you sick of being the mayor's workhorse all the time? The underdog? That unappreciated henchman in this unlawful operation? Come on, surely you want a better life than this. Thank you. Come on, let's go. Roland? Roland! <sighs> this is what my dream was trying to show me, then why hasn't it ended? What? Nothing. The city is that way. Stop by Station Bravo and check on my friend Ben for me. I have something to finish. Sure. And thank you. No problem. Now hurry. I have to wait for our friend. No, it doesn't in here! I'm sorry, Mr. Young, but I'm afraid it does. So what now? You talked about how I'm such a rarity, and now you're just going to shoot me in cold blood? Of course not. Tom, would you do the honor? What? You heard me. Shoot him! <sighs> you? Are you Ben? Yes, what's going on? Ryan wanted me to find you. Where is he? I don't know. I think he was heading towards the helipad off the cliff. Why would he go there? I don't know. Something about the ending of to his dream? Oh no. Hey! Where are you going? Well, we're waiting, Tom. Roland! Shoot him! I knew you wouldn't kill him. Then why did you have me shoot? I spared him only so he could complete our task. This whole ordeal will have no effect on the future where to build. This never happened, do you understand? I want a full search of the area, and don't stop until you find him. I can't believe it. I'm sorry. He seemed like a really great guy. He was. I should have listened. Then unexplored patches arose in it and spread. Black shadows moved about in them. The roar of the beasts of prey was quite different now, and above all, 
You lost the certainty that you would win. What's up, Ryan? You look down. I've just been thinking a lot about the end. I mean, when everything's over, for me at least, Will I have done something so I can say that I am truly satisfied with my time here on Earth? When at last the heavens were steady again, I found myself alone in the darkness.